Oh, we want to welcome everyone to our new show, our Stereotypical Topics. This is episode one. We're so excited to be here. Now, uh, I'm the narcoleptic correspondent, so I'll be your host today, and I'll be presenting the latest A-listed stereotypical guests with the latest, hottest topics, strangest topics, even the most boring stereotypical topics. Thank you. Thank you. We have a great lineup of guests today. Uh, we'll be discussing Windows' latest version, Windows 77. And uh, we have Mr. Snowburn. From, uh, he's a cattle king from Texas. We have Bellstone, a Sudoku car champion, straight from our friendly neighbor across the ocean, England. We also have a special treat there, Mr. Cool Forever. He's the hoppinest hip hopper. <laughs> and we also have Drury, our downstairs computer technician. Okay. Well, now, now, for those of you that are not familiar with computers, this is the latest operating system for your computer. Uh, with what I hear is a few new features. Now, these features are supposed to make your computer more friendly, you know, user friendly, and make it more fun to navigate, uh, and navigate programs and search the internet. So, uh, uh, let's uh, get a picture of it here. The latest uh, software. Oh, can, can we get a close up on that? Is that good? Let's see. Is that good? Too big? Yeah, let's get it there. How's that? Oh, cool. Yeah, there we go. Okay, great. Great, 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 great new uh, software here. Now, it it does have a disclaimer here. It does say, uh, this is not an official brand name brand. Use it at your own risk. All rights exclusive to creator. But have fun trying it out anyway. Uh, don't worry, we'll work out the bug. And if we can't, we'll just make a new version for you to explore. Hey, how fair is that? Okay, and uh, uh, this particular version here is version... Uh, Windows version 77.255.225.2 beta uh, came out March 2010. So it is, it's brand new and uh, it's, uh, it says uh, surf easier, navigate easier, let your imagination go outside the box as you look through Windows 77. Good stuff. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, you can see there's a lot of... Uh, Users out there. Okay, great. Well, let's see. Let's look at our list here. Let's get to our guests. And uh, so, okay, so first. Okay, first, let's have our cattle king come out. Okay. Uh, everyone, welcome Mr. Snowburn. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Okay, well, welcome to you, Mr. Snowburn. Now, just quickly, you are known as the Cattle King. Why is that? Well, no, I don't really think, uh, or oh, be called King, uh, you know. Uh, I do have me a whole mess of cat. Well, I suppose a little, lot more around all the people, but, uh, well, hmm, Alright, well, let's hear it for the Cattle King, hey? Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Now, uh, let's see our next guest. We have the Sudukar champion, Bellstone.
so tell us, Bellstone, uh, how did you become a Sudukar champion? Uh, oh, and for those of you that don't know, Sudukar is a game of numbers. Bunch of numbers. Yeah. Okay. I've always loved playing Sudukar, uh, and I've beat a lot of people uh, who, who had quite as skilled as I am. You know. Apparently they weren't really equally skilled because you beat them. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, next we have our hip-hop star. Let's give it up for Mr. Cool Forever. That's right, and I hear your latest album has been number one for at least six weeks now. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, we got that right. And I'm living large. What a The audience really loves you. That's right. Okay, moving on. Let's welcome our downstairs computer technician, whom we all depend on and love, Gloria. Welcome, Gloria. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thanks. <laughs> No way! He's... No way! You... That's right! Oh man, can I have your autograph? Cheers! Okay, while well, they're becoming BFFs, let's get to our topic of the day. Mr. Snowburn, you mentioned you just updated to new Windows 77. Uh, how would you rate its performance? Don't actually recollect saying that. Windows 77, huh? Well, I, I, I don't seem the commercials. Look mighty fine. Looks mighty fine. I suppose I, I suppose could put my cattle. And use it for, uh, yeah, just my cattle. Or keep track of my cattle. I see. Wonderful, wonderful. Uh, how about you, Belson? Uh, how have you enjoyed the new features of Windows 77? Oh, yes. Oh, oh, I really love the idea of it, really. Actually, uh, well, I, I, I haven't had the chance to really use it. But I uh, hear yeah, it's really nice. I see. Oh, oh, great. And, uh, well, uh, how about you, Mr. Forever. Uh, what did you think about Windows 77? It's the bomb, B. The bomb, nice. Bomb? Did, did you say bomb? Bomb? You ain't seen the bomb, did you see old Pete's, Pete's mountain? What they done did it to it? Yeah, they did. They say there's some youngins. They, uh, they say they guess and they was up there with some firecrackers or and them ladyfingers? No. No. Firecrackers. Firecrackers. No, peeps. No. No. He, he means it's like, he means it's like cool. Uh, awesome. Great. You know, like my hand. <laughs> so, wait. Everyone remain calm. 
Sorry, I... I was dreaming, I think. <clears throat> well, uh... <clears throat> yeah. Yes, Corby. I dare say you have to turn it off. Damn! You be right. Feel some there. <laughs> I've never seen no woman fall asleep with their eyes open before. Yeah, yeah that's something. Caution. To be fine, right? Good boys, you then fell asleep right after a catagraph. You know, we walk around and go, go uh, slipping in some. We was living in a uh, man trap done by a fuck moss head. Fuck my ass. <laughs> well, yeah, I'd been there. Yeah. You go back to England. I speak this fine. Oh, come on now. You all just guess. You all guess here. And, and, and welcome to speak freely, but unless I get riled up here, uh, I'm all friends, right? That's right. That's what I'm talking about. Fresh air. I speak a language that resembles some sort of, of comprehensible structure. I like this for another guest, I dare not name, whose it I dare say is no name at all, but barely a type of statement. Oh, no, you didn't. You didn't just diss me. Rise up, fool! Hey, hey now. Oh, oh! Oh, great, you guys. Now you got him upset. Don't you guys know that the narcoleptic correspondence has cataplexy? Cataplexy. 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 Just a minute. He'll be back up in no time. Can what? What up? I oh, say, is he dead? Well, he went in for a call right to the island, though. Can you say? No, no, no. I mean, leave him alone. No, no, just, just. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Okay. That's it. Cool. Is there a cat? I think there's a cat around here. No, cat plexi. Ha. Oh, there. That's rather thoughtful. Listen it. Raffle? Nah. <laughs> you ain't seen Raffle till you see what happened to a old damn horse and something. Now, that was a, what you say there, Raffle? Yeah, yeah. Listen, Dan Parsons' son, he fell right in a heap of freshly shooed greasy sheep wool. <sighs> Took him hours to find him. Guess they finally just decided to go ahead and uh, clean it up, you know, um, uh, decided to go ahead and scour the greasy wool. And, uh, <sighs> Cleanest kid you ever done saw. All them detergents and half of the holes with them hot water. Well, maybe it wasn't too hot. 
Looks a bit rightful looking though. Yeah. Shiny. <laughs> I don't think that's quite the same. Well, I don't know. We could have had the plexus. Yeah. Yeah, we have to figure what Tarnation Kid was doing in Big Old Cheek for Cheek Bowl, anyways. <laughs> oh, enough, Hess. Enough of the name calling now, please. Yes, sorry. So you all better cool it, I except you, Mr. Cool. <laughs> so, hey, 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 hey. Do you wanna know what I think of Windows 77? Of course, Jory. Please do share that with us. It gave me a huge bruise. I know we we'll had it for more than 20 minutes, freshly installed, and then, well, you know, I, uh, uh, I went to go get a coffee, and I went to go get a coffee, and saw a big old welcome sign on the window, you know, I mean, on the, on the screen, on the monitor, well, uh, I was so excited, I just, I ran to my, my computer, and when she know, I ran my knee right into the CPU, got me all this, this it caused me to spill my coffee everywhere, and, well, and spots went flying, and, well, you know, I got the, the blue screen of death. No. The blue screen of death. It's not a known screen of death. Whatever flying says blue, with a nasty code air. Shut down. I, I yanked the computer out of the plug, you know, out of the. Uh, I yanked the plug, the computer plug right out of the surge protector, and then I, I yanked the keyboard right off the view. And I, I threw it down on the floor and shot out the flames. And then, and then I went and I found me one of them firemen, fire emergency axes, and then I came back. Computer and I, I stacked the monitor of all the pieces. You got rid of my good man. Now that deserves some blame. Thank you. Thank, thank you. It's to come forever. Well, 
back to the topic of the day, uh, today's topic, Windows 77. I take it that none of you have actually tried it out? Yeah. I don't believe so, Ashley. No. Can't you help them? Yeah. You know, there ain't exactly electrical plugs out on cattle drives. You know. Uh, of course, uh, I, I could have bought a laptop. Uh, I don't know what could have done me, though, because we uh, uh, ran out of batteries. Oh, she's a cattle king. Surely you could afford batteries. Who surely? Well, uh, Anyway, so, yeah, I suppose I could have bought, bought me some batteries if I could have found the time. But, uh, I not much for electrical stores out there either now, you know, wilderness and all. I was under the impression that the modern-day cowboys didn't have to uh, do cattle drives. Oh, well, uh, oh, well, <laughs> you, we, we, which we would really do with just for the fun of it, you see, you know, see you know, it's uh, kind of like, um, um, well, it's a celebration, you know, like a tradition, yeah. You know, my, my, my papa did it, my grandpappy did it, well, I suppose my great grandpappy did it, and, you know, them pioneers, you know, yeah, long, long, Long line of cattle, cattle steering. Uh, I mean, uh, you know, cattle drives. <laughs> we all find fun doing different things now, don't we? Uh, it sounds a bit stressful to me, but um, hey, let's keep the traditions alive. Am I right? Bye, Gooten. Right, so, uh, Rory, uh, we just have a few seconds left on the show, but. Can I quickly address the situation with the computer? I don't know what situation you're talking about, but, uh, okay. Right, but I'm a little concerned about the destruction of company property. What? Uh, I didn't do anything like that. Besides that, I filled out, though, warranties and insurance forms already. And there's no one supposed to be shipped uh, in the next few days. Oh, uh, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. That concludes our show. Stereotypical topics for today. Come back next again, or next time, for our next episode where we'll discuss the topics important to you. Or not. Take care, everyone. Peace and love. Peace out. Come on, y'all. Come on.